<laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, what's up, Bear? What's up? Um. Yes. Oh, yes. Yeah, yeah, the verifying is annoying. Um, I'll have to host. Jar is going to be replacing Christian today. Christian's power went out. So, yeah. yeah. Um, but Jar and I tested. He's able to join it. So, we should be ready to go. Twenty five FPS on All right. Hey, what's going on folks? Yeah, I was muted on my mic for a minute. Um and there's nothing in the background at the moment because my game is updating. I had to do like a cache verify and Warhammer three has all the gigabytes. <laughs> so even with a very good download connection, which I do have, my upload connection is usually the one that's sketchy. I have a very good download connection. Um, it still takes forever because it has to install a ton of files, and that's even with an SSD and all the other stuff that makes it faster. So just a big game. So you all have to hold on for just a moment. I have something we can cover in the meantime. You all let me know if you can hear me now, though. I think you should be able to. So can just say something in the chat. Jack in the Box, HH Ray, Stranger, Red Baron, Blake, Senshi, myself, welcome me, <laughs> Deadly Sin, thanks for being here, Technologist, Regina, good to see you. All right, Blake, appreciate it, everybody. Thanks for letting me know that the volume is on now. So here in just a moment, I will be joining um, Pilgrim and Jar, I think, are going to be the ones that are playing with me tonight. So Pilgrim and Jar are going to be playing some Something Rotten and Kislev campaign with me. Um, but my game, like I said, it's still updating. I'm keeping an eye on it. Should be done soon. Um, so I figured we could take a look at a couple of these things that CA shared today on their Twitters about, um, you know, it was like the, the questions that got asked to their team and they answered some of the questions. I don't even know if there's anything good here. I haven't had a chance to look at it because I was at the office for like eight and a half or nine hours today and got home, spent the time with the kids. And so, yeah, I haven't gotten to look at this yet. Um, so apparently these are some questions that they asked and some of the questions, it's like, who are you and what you do? No, no offense to Mitch. Mitch is great, but you know, yeah, we're going to bypass that one. Um, what are you working on this week? Um, it says that they're working on, it says they're getting plans in place for a, the beta period of Immortal Empire's release, gearing up to take on board everyone's feedback and having a think about how we're going to be uh, go about acting in it. So it sounds like they're putting together some final pieces of their plan on how they receive feedback, how they prioritize it, and what they do to go take action on it. So I mean, that makes sense. Um, makes sense. That that's what they should be working on. So not a big surprise there. <laughs> Um, is there anything exciting you can share? Oh, I can share something exciting, folks. You know what? Here, here. People really like all the speculation videos, right? People like to speculate about what's coming next. I'll tell you, there's no need to speculate. I already know the first DLC coming to the game, all right? Y'all ready for this? I already know it. Like, I literally know. I'm, I'm going to divulge it to you here. Y'all think you can handle it? Like, we're, we're ready to handle this? Okay. You ready? All right. Here it is. It's, they're, they're going to be bringing in Chaos Lizard Halflings, okay? Chaos Lizard Halfling are definitely going to be the next DLC, all right? You heard it here first. This is why I don't do speculation videos, because there is no speculation. I, I'm just right. You know what I mean? Like, there's no questioning that this is right. I mean, clearly... What I just mentioned, whatever it was, is definitely in all the army books, and it's coming next. So there, there you go. That's what's coming next, in case you all wanted to know. <laughs> so I guess that's it. That, that's, that's not very exciting. CA, please. Um, let's see. Oh, they announced the Dark Elves start positions today, too. Let's take a look at that. Wait, Nikki doesn't... Nikki has zero salt pennies? How is this possible? What's going on with the bot? pennies get reset are they bigger does anybody have all pennies okay all right so anyway so here's the the start positions for the dark elves um i think malachis the same pretty sure 
that um, Hellebron's in the same spot. Marathi's roughly in the... Well, I guess we could look at the actual... Yeah, so Marathi's still in Ancient City. Malekith at Nagaron. Harganeth for Crone. Lokir moved over to the Cathay Coast. Now, this could be fun for Lokir. He's got access to a lot of coast to raid. Um, and he could hit the sea lanes, of course, and go raid other coast. Uh, Malice Darkblade. So he was here where Papa Nurgle's at now. Um, but it looks like he's at Black Rock and owns Hag Grief. So, okay, here's, yeah, here's Malice. Yeah, so he's down in Lustria, so that's a change. Rackarth is at the Great Turtle Isle. Or no, no, that's Rackarth. I'm looking at these wrong. Malice is up here. Yeah, Hag Grief. Yeah, I think this one's Hag Grief, right? This, I think, I'm thinking, yeah, Turtle Isles, because it says Great Turtle Isles. So this is Rackarth. This one's Malice. That one's Hellebron. So yeah. Um, so it is a change for Malice. I wonder why they didn't put him over here again. Like, is this more, is this more lore appropriate or something? Malice is fighting demons. Yeah, that's right. That's what it looks like, Pilgrim. Let me check out my game. Hallelujah. My game is updated. All right, so I'm going to turn off my display capture. I'm going to get the game started up, and I'm going to go join uh, Pilgrim and Jar. We're going to play some Warhammer 3. This is what you all came here for, right? Let me make sure everything is set to go. Deactivate all mods. Yep, play. There we go. All right, so we're getting the game up, and we'll get started. But yeah, so that's the latest news. Nothing crazy exciting today. What do y'all think of Lokir's start? I definitely think that's a, a better start. Since Malice was kind of possessed, after all. A lot more to deal with the Chaos Waste. Yeah, I mean, Malice was... Well, he was possessed by a Chaos Demon, right? Zarkon was... Was that like some kind of Zinch spirit or something? It sounds like something Zinchy, but then again, I could be wrong. Dark Elves are such a good faction. Kind of doesn't matter where you put them. They all do well. Ain't no meaning. Yeah, I, I agree that the Dark Elves are a really fun faction as well. So, no disagreement from me there. Let me get into the voice chat here. So, I'm going to go into admin. Got to pull Pilgrim in here. Uh, move to... <laughs> what's up? Hey, what's up? Does that feel like you're just getting, like, the cane on the stage and someone's just yanking you in? Oh, yeah. Like, full with cartoon sound effects and everything. Yeah. You know? It's like the Bugs Bunny cartoon. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> hey, thanks for playing this tonight. Do you have it hosted? Yeah, I have it hosted. I'll go ahead and invite you. Excellent. Uh, let's see. If you're online. Uh, what's the game name? Um, I don't know. <laughs> Um, here, I, I, yeah, I, I have you on. Is it something so, rotten? But yeah. Probably, probably, maybe. I mean, that um, would make I, sense. Alright, I, I think I'm in. Yep, there you are. Alright. I'm ready to slap. Oh man, there's gonna be a lot of Nurgle slapping. Oh yeah. I'm, I'm feeling confident we'll get past part one. Um. <laughs> I part hope so. two, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully we'll make it past part one. We'll, like, see, we'll the, see how this the goes. Zinch, the Zinch ambush armies are pretty ridiculous. The Slaneshi armies tear us apart in the open field, and then Korn's just, well, Korn. <laughs> Zarkon is a Slaneshi demon? Yeah. Huh. The, the Malice Zarkon is a Slaneshi. For some reason, they, get, they made Zarkon a Zinch name in this game. <laughs> Interesting. But, but the one with Malice is Slaneshi. I remember I got to play um, early access to that DLC a long time ago. And it yep. was it was still so early that they had like all this placeholder stuff in it. <laughs> and oh. <laughs> there was a placeholder voice line, like the auto speak thing. And uh -huh. when Malice would be talking, he'd say TZ Archon. <laughs> it's just like, going, it was hilarious. It was so messed up. It was like the Google oh, oh. Navigate was calling out the game or something. Yeah, like like the text to speech. Yes, text to speech. Yes, that's oh, exactly. My it was hilarious. 
we were joking with CA. We're like, no, no, you just need to leave it. Like this is, like this is pure gold. It's perfect. Um, Christian came up with a really good name for a Nurgle general, but since we're not Nurgle, I'm gonna name my Ice Witch it. Um, her name's gonna be Stink Wrinkle. Stink Wrinkle. <laughs> <laughs> that is a very appropriate name for Nurgle. Oh no. Irina Stink Wrinkle. <laughs> So I always heard uh, like the, sh the streamers and all the young cool people, not not old people like me, right? They're, they're going after someone in the game, right? They're clapping cheeks. Boy, you don't oh, want yeah, you, you don't want yeah, that I... from Nurgle. No. 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 His, no. his reasons are. <laughs> and it's another different meeting when it comes to to Nakari. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh no. <laughs> Devastating flanker. Bella, Bellacore is going to be talking to you when you show up the Forge of Souls. He's going to be like, show me where Nakari touched you. Uh, yeah. <laughs> though, though, if if you do get the clap from Nurgle, at least it will remove stock from you because people will just hear you coming. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Awful. Alright, well, let's kill Nurgle. He, yes, let's do this. Um, <laughs> what do we need? So I can't move because I'm recruiting some Kassars. Yeah. Yeah, I can't move either. I'm probably but... gonna go into the negative when I get him. Oh, I'm sure. Actually, I'm wondering if that army's actually gonna come attack me. Uh, hope not. <laughs> I I if he attacks me, that's gonna ruin my recruitment yeah. pretty badly. Uh, but if I move now, that will also destroy my stuff pretty badly. Bundles, exporting, well, okay, so I'm only exporting 42% right. of Hey, how come y'all don't buy more of my furs? Come on. Oh. It's, oh, they're quality know. furs, like, straight off of Nurgle's back, you oh. know, that hairy patch on his back? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Fell. Qu Who's quality wear. What news Apparently we can't Inherits give or take homo. money from each other. Interesting. Oh no, I guess <laughs> really? they don't let you do that. No, I was gonna try and bolster up, like, do more fur trade, but apparently you all have uh, had all of the, you know, disgusting Nurgle skins that you can handle. Yeah, I was just gonna send a trade agreement where you give me $5,000 and I receive $5,000. <laughs> Is there, like, some way to embezzle? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, CA, <laughs> add that into the game. We can do some money laundering. Like, I pass the money to you, you pass it to someone else. You yeah. work it through Zinch's bank. Comes <laughs> out the other side. Yeah. Embarrazled. <laughs> what news do you bring to the uh, ice cluster throne, Cluster Pox friend? is going to be annoying. All right, Jar, I definitely think you're good to go to attack that city of Zoyshank. Okay. Um, um, Sterland's giving me a thousand gold just for giving them access. That sounds well, great. Well, there, there, there's your embezzlement. Yeah, I know. That's <laughs> perfect. <laughs> What's Sterling gonna do? <laughs> They're like that Philip Fry meme where he's saying, "Shut up and take my money." <laughs> oh yeah. All right, you ready to move up? I'm ready. Yep, to move I'm up. ready to. I can hey, attack the settlement if you want. Uh, I'll, I'll attack it. So okay. Just grab it. But um, oh, heroic. Yeah, encircle it. Can you encircle it? Because I'm not there behind you yet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, yeah. Okay, ally. here we go. Apparently, it's a heroic victory if I auto resolve that. <laughs> well, now it's gonna be a doubly heroic. Decisive <laughs> defeat. No. <laughs> we'll, we'll go ahead and just yes, auto resolve. Yes, 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 yes. Auto resolve. Okay, Whoops! Anything. I hit fight. Oh well. All right, we gotta fight it then. <laughs> Are we gonna lose units? Maybe. Oops. I I don't know. We'll My see. bad. Yeah, it's alright. You have to bear with me. Huh? Oh. I see Reggie oh. bit you. <laughs> Reggie bit you in the dead of night, you're turning into her. Yeah. Air once put. I do. Well, I mean, does Nurgle have blood? Or is it, is no, it more like... No, probably you know, not. Uh, it's, it's just, it's, it's like it's, pus. Yeah, it's, that's what I was thinking. It's probably so viscous that it's more like syrup. Mm-hmm, yeah. And corn probably doesn't like that at all. <laughs> No. So Regina just got. I, I like this. So you can you can put scam bots on YouTube chat all day long, and there'll be a sex bot in here later that I'll have to to ban. Oh, but Regina got her comment automatically censored by YouTube for saying pus. <laughs> 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 so oh, let's go. pus hey, is a bridge too you? far. But if you want to you want to scam people, 
Hey. Reggie. Reggie. <laughs> Maybe the rest of the spot are the friends we made along the way. Yeah. You gotta love not. YouTube's priorities. It's nothing short of hilarious. Alright, so I could try cutting off the enemy army over here. That might go poorly. I don't know. I've got a pretty sizable army, but I'm. Uh, I, if I move my thing, it takes me a lot longer to get there, right? Do you remember how many units were in the garrison? Because I might be able to overwhelm them if I do this right. I Honestly, I would just start... Well, their reinforcements are coming from the other side, huh? Yeah. Wish. And I don't know if I can actually take the reinforcements out on my okay, own. Okay, so I can see the reinforcements. They got four Forsaken, um, yeah, four it's, Plague Bearers. It's, like, I mean, it's, it's a pretty nasty. tanky army. They, they've also yeah. got a... What do you it's call it? A soul nasty. grinder. Some spawn. Yeah, yeah we might want to just leave them and... Try and blitz the settlement. Yeah. Start focusing okay. down the guys on this side. Alright, well, at least I got bears. You got TZR guard, so... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see, Legamus said that uh, the Nurgle blood is diabetic syrup blood. Yeah, that's, that's uh, yep. exactly what I was thinking, man. Yep. Like... Well, if there's something that's going to ruin your pancakes, that's it. Like, mm -hmm. Korn's normally really angry, but I imagine if he sees Nurgle blood, he just gets even more angry. Like, how could you defile this? <laughs> yeah. And then Nurgle just, like farts or something. I don't know. Ooh, I forgot you got little Gromby. Yeah, buddy. Little, little Grom's Grom gonna boy. show him what's up. You should start loading dwarves in there and they can call it little Grom Brindle. Apparently oh, little Grom no. is obscured. <laughs> or obstructed. Why? <laughs> Why is he obstructed? <laughs> uh, obstruction of missiles is so bad in this game, but you know, I guess it's better that they're obstructed than you can literally just shoot through your own units. Yeah. yeah. Oh man, the AI didn't defend this spot? Maybe. I mean... That's so weird. I guess not. Uh, grab I'm that not capture gonna... point. I mean, that's extra yeah, yeah, melee. Absolutely. absolutely. Doesn't it start to add up to like <laughs> potentially like 20% melee attack or something? Some, something crazy. And we need it. Um, Char, I'm gonna give you the Zargard. I'm gonna trust you with these guys. Oh, They're the no. best of the best. Okay. Take good care of them. Little old Grom is still. I a I will do my oh, best. My goodness. Yes! Come on. <laughs> Daddy Boris loves his Zargard. Don't we all? Like, really I know good. I know the armored Kosars get like you know missile shots and everything, but these Zargard against Nurgle just hold. For decades. Yeah, like. that's what I would think. The armor is hard for Nurgle to get through. The armor and really good melee defense. Like, oh, that's right. They've got really good melee defense. They're just kind of low on attack. Didn't yeah, they buff like, the uh, Zargard like, with great weapons in the last patch? Um, maybe. I think they gave him like a hair extra melee defense or something. It wasn't much. I, I think so. I think you're right. Barely an increase. Yes, barely. Oh, oh gosh. Oh. The bear puns are gonna get really low tonight, folks. Yeah. <laughs> bear puns are polarizing at best. Yes, yes. Oh. <laughs> I love it. Oh, All right, you're, you're not capturing over. this. You're not capturing this, stupid Nurgle. Die! Boris is such a Chad, I cannot wait for his Immortal Empire start just being in the middle of demon territory. Yeah. Oh, that is going to be good. I, he's not trapped there with them. Wait. So he's, he's going full ice, Chad. Oh, yeah. absolutely. I can't believe they just let us march in and snag like two of these capture points. It's Nurgle's big brain. Yeah, I mean, that's... I'll take that Nurgle's because then when we capture it, they can't build towers and stuff too, so it's... <laughs> Nurgle's like, yes, I'm a genius, just like Kairos. <laughs> oh, wait. <laughs> I done goofed. Or maybe Zinch is just with us this day. 
bring Papa Bear a can of Coke. Oh yeah, I mean, oh gosh, the, the yes. Coke meme has to come in. Maybe some that that needs to be a meme. Maybe I can get Warner to work on that for me. Make, make me like a Horus on his bear and then <laughs> pack a Coca Cola up there. Heck yeah. Yeah, you gotta call it something generic though, otherwise. Oh, that's true. We'll probably get sued by Coca Cola. Games Workshop will claim they invented Coca-Cola. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that too. That's right. Games Workshop gets pretty protective. <laughs> Go with honor. Like, um, actually. Yeah. Hey. When you think of Warhammer, you think of Coca-Cola. Stinking soul grinder. I mean, who watch doesn't, it. right? I don't want to watch the soul grinder. It's gross. Yeah, it, it is <laughs> disgusting. It's a lot of... It's a lot of gross. Jiggling and pus and... You know, jigg so jiggling I can handle when we're talking ogres, you know, then then it's appropriate. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, gosh, those stupid Nurgle butt heads up there. Oh, the plague drones, the sound gets to me. Yeah, they're, they're gross. Yeah. I'll tell you what's going to be fun is dropping an Ica Claw nuke on the uh, the Nurglings. Like, you get them in a big blob and then just, like, <laughs> doom rocket. For whatever faults you may say about this game, at least the units look fantastic. <laughs> yeah, they do. The the visual right. models, like, when I go back and play game two, it's not like the game looks like crap, but it, it does look oh, a lot better in game three. Yeah. All right, Jar, hold up those uh, Nurgle dummies. All right, called. that's one Part dead. Stinky, or ice. I've stinky. killed the soul grinder. That's doing some Sick. good damage on him. That was Ooh, good damage. Yeah, yeah. Is that the hailstorm? Uh, yeah. I, I could do the blizzard. Um, I can do heart of winter. I'll charge in and drop a heart of winter there. Oh, Reggie loves the heart. Amoeba's probably crying right now that we're fighting her. <laughs> oh, look at that! Yeah, that's, that. that's nice. pretty good. Yeah. I think heart, is Heart of Winter where Zarina Katarin comes in and starts giving Turkish delight to all her enemies. <laughs> oh, wait, wrong, wrong movie. My, uh... Then Mr. Tumnus and the Beastmen invade. Oh, okay. Good old Mr. Tumnus who could forget such a thing. <laughs> he is totally a. Uh... Oh, crap. Why am I forgetting my Beastmen names now? He's an Ungor. <laughs> yes, he is totally an Ungor. Like, I, I mean, Games Workshop definitely needs to start the lawsuit. <laughs> After all, we know Games Workshop invented satyrs and centaurs. Priests just true. stole them. <laughs> I can do a double Heart of Winter here. I got one going with Zarina Catter and then I can drop another. We are trashing the fools up here. We are crumping and slapping them. Okay. Uh oh, uh oh. Get out of there. Get out of there. Get out of there, Bear Cav. You're you're awesome, but I don't want to be fighting. Oh yeah, that Heart of Winter did some work. Oh yeah. Alright, I'm basically out of magic. Right? I've uh, got enough but, to drop another Heart of Winter, so we can get another but, good blob going. We basically got rid of the carrots. <laughs> <laughs> like they're they're pretty much gone. And we've got a 60% on momentum. So. Yeah, they're they're slowly catching oh, I took one back. back yeah. because it's all right. Well, there's just a big army coming in. Lord Unspew Lord of Agu. It's oh. weird to me that it's pronounced Agu. I thought it was ache, like plague, but it's Agu. It's just oh, I can't do graphic stuff. Oh, these Forsaken are gonna have a real bad time against these war bears. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, keep that blob over there. Alright. Uh oh. They just, uh. Spirit Leech. No, oh, they. Well, Spirit Leech kinda sucks, actually. That's not good. <laughs> Man, I hate the freaking poison on Nurgle. Like, you just cannot get through them. <laughs> yeah. But, they're having a real hard time getting through us. So. Alright, I'm trying to get over there and drop a Heart of Winter on that blob you're fighting, so give me just a second. I'm trying to come around. Is. Ketterin on her, uh... She's bear. on the bear, but my okay. caster is on a horse. Gotcha. So she's having a lot of trouble. The motherland's finest! Undermage! 
Come on, Boris. Slap those demons. Oh my gosh. Get out of there, Zarina. Repositioning. Slap those demons. Frost made that beast in Urgul is getting absolutely Heck yeah. Oh, half wonder. Well, no, they're not headed that way. Yeah, I'll just go ahead and hard up with Well, we'll see what's left of that blob when the hailstorm gets it. Oh yeah, we're 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 slapping them. The Call me the Coca-Cola lawsuit. Yeah, I think if anything here, the auto resolve was giving them way too much of a chance. Yeah. Oh no, the auto resolve basically said I lost maybe a Kosar. <laughs> Uh, it wasn't really? anything like egregious. Like it was pretty good on the resolve. That's but my war um, bears are definitely gonna hit. Check out the uh, the bear mosh pit that the Herald of Nurgle's in over on my sleds. Ah, uh, Fecaligus! Ah, uh, get out of here! Uh -oh. Good old cluster pox over here is trapped with uh -oh. a bunch of bears. <laughs> Yeah, he's he's right in the middle of an angry bear circus here. This is. Fecaligus is showing me what he ate this morning. Oh, oh sweet. There's oh, the. Uh, no. What do they call it? Disintegrating or. Yeah, yeah, the banishment. Banishment, okay. Demonic instability. What do y'all think Got about it. the uh, the demon factions versus like. <clears throat> Let's think game one factions for a minute. Like, I'm... Oh, I cannot wait to see how the vampire counts handle the various demons. <laughs> so that, that was something I was thinking through too. Like the counts, I mean, Nurgle would so, probably resist the counts the best, don't you think? Oh, I don't know if you saw this, but um, in one of the uh, FAQ questions, people brought that up, like with the demons having, you know, good physical resist and vampire counts having a bit terrible amount of uh, magic damage on their units themselves they said they're gonna give the vampire count some more extra one upage essentially to help interesting them. i don't know what that is they didn't specify but like obviously you have spells that can help you but they could just bring back like, um game one patch one spirit leech and buna and then oh god <laughs> no please <laughs> the death star with the auto delete spells <laughs> they, they, yeah they, they just make it so vampire counts don't have a healing cap anymore yes <laughs> that was brutal no. man. vampire just gets their old demigriffs back <laughs> <laughs> demigriffs were pretty potent demigod griffs <laughs> demigods that's perfect oh all right goodness. yeah we 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 slap these guys uh, I think I'm gonna take the cash money. Yeah. Um, cash money. Bleeding a little. Flow. Ooh, minus eight percent upkeep for Zargard. That's gonna help my money. Of Hell yeah. Is it too Bonus much? Ursus. Too much corruption there. What's the corruption? All right. So we what should I? Pretty hundred percent Nurgle corruption everywhere, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Should I buy more war bears? The answer is yes. I can't replenish until the next they, turn. They are so expensive, though. So what? What's the next push? Uh, for Ostrask. So we've got to completely liberate Northern Oblast, right? Yeah. All right. So Jar's pushing in on Septic Claw up there. Good, good, yeah. good, good, good. It says I can auto resolve with a Pyrrhic victory, but I lose. Ooh. A uh, lot. Pyr Pyrrhic. Okay. So if you lose a lot, how much money do you have? Mm, that's a good question. I ordered their death. Because if you have a 8K. lot of money, because if you have a lot of money and you can just re-recruit really quickly, that would be fine. But if you just don't want to spend the time re-recruiting, well, that would also be good. yeah, and he's suffering attrition too, so yeah, you're gonna have to do a certain amount of recruiting in order to replenish. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. Okay. Be proud, men of Kislev. Whew. Oh, I'm getting Discord messages. I wonder if I am being Blessings born. of the bear. So we've got oh, yeah. Soy Shank. So Fort Ostrosk is the last one for our victory condition. Oh, okay, so you on, did. Yeah. On yep. number one, at least. Yep. Part one. Yep. So we're we're making really great time right now. Excellent. None shall kiss. Alright, well, I can start moving forward in a 
like encamped stance on the next turn and just start recruiting okay. or yeah, replenishing I should say. Recruitment cost reduction would be really good. As one with Urson. Interesting. So as one with Urson for uh, Boris you makes me dead. lose eight leadership, but it makes me get five extra leadership in my aura, and it makes the enemy lose eight leadership. Hmm. That's hmm. that sounds really strong. It's not like Boris ever routes anyway. <laughs> that sounds very strong. A gift from Kislev's great god. Got Katarin's magic pretty well pumped up. Pumped up kicks. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, oh, there we go. I, I could get Dawes' hearse bearers. Yes. Hearse bearers. <laughs> the the hearse blades. I mean. I cannot eradicate Gale Saloon. Yes, I'm getting extra income from Dawes right now. All right. So worried to spend my money. See that reduces the upkeep of my ice guard by even more. All right. Do I need swift wing? I mean, that makes bears really fast. Do it. Do it. I mean, once you do it. <laughs> or, I could also, I could get Swiftwing and Guardian Call where I can summon Snow Leopards. Yeah, let's do that. Big deal. <laughs> Trade agreements available. CA, please. Oh, well, I I think this campaign's just a little special. Uh, they just, like, we're giving you all the money anyway. I want to peddle my <laughs> crappy furs. I got low-quality rat skin, okay? May not oh, be the no. best. Keep your ears warm. Good prices. I'm sorry, I'm trying to hurry up. There's lots of stuff. <laughs> Used and abused Skaven pelts? Yes. Straight off the Skaven Slaves. Not even the good Skaven. Gently oh, used yeah. Skaven Slaves. The only thing they've had to eat in the last three or four weeks before being skinned was warp stone and, like, feces. Mm. That sounds wretched. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. That's the most appetizing thing I've ever heard. <laughs> oh, good. Tox Farter and his friend Grand Vomitus are showing up. <laughs> Out here. All right. Committee of State Security. Oh. All Sounds right. uh, very tyrannical. I like it. You want to help me <laughs> take out Grand Vomitus and his friend really over there? Tough. Yeah. Hold on, just a second. Let me. I gotta pick a. I mean, yes. lens crafters. I do need glasses. Like, say, so I can do that one. But... Come from Heck trade. Yeah. Oh, stupid hell pit sent pestil, pestilich. The insane after me. <laughs> Hang on, they sent rats after us? Yeah, there, there's like this weird walking rat. I don't know what it is. It, he's got goggles. I think it's Sonic. Your Tsarina oh, looks true. after you. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I see. Alright, so who do we want to attack? Uh, Tox Farter. Okay. If you wanna, if you want I've me got, to do the attack, that'll leave me with more than 50% movement, so I think I can get into the camp afterwards. Okay. All right. You can also just wait. If you go into a camp stance, can you still reinforce? I think so. Yeah, try that. Just like go into a camp stance and move up close to him, and then we'll see what's what. Ambush chance? Oh, so it makes you more likely to be ambushed, or what? What is that? No. Bring me oh, to my tent. What? The in camp stance it said ambush chance plus seventy-five percent. Oh, defense chance. Ambush defense chance. Okay. Makes you less likely to be ambushed. All right, we could just auto resolve this. Yes, I will actually click the right button this time. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, I clicked the wrong button. Oh no. Bear. Oh, I could give Strider to a unit. That'd be sick. Give me that money. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep going money. The replenishment is really bad. I got six thousand money off of that. Oh, oh gosh. plague. I'm not taking attrition yet. Well, didn't they update got... the plagues, like, so that... Mm -hmm. 
It has to be like a very certain one where you take attrition. Maybe, I don't know, it doesn't feel like that right now. <laughs> um, one of the ones, the one that Castalton has right now, uh, it doesn't so cause any attrition. That's what I'm saying, I don't either. I think they changed it to where... Well, it does... Um, well, I'm unlucky then, because I have Boy, attrition. <laughs> I have palsy. Okay, so it's the one that's on... Oh. Uh, Jar's second army. Oh, Agu oh, or whatever, Agu, what, yeah, however you pronounce that. I, I don't, I don't yeah. do pronunciation. Mistress of Ice. Hello, Baloo. The Tarina. All right. Well, stupid Nurgle. All right. Spread Ursun's love. So Bordis goes. Hey, I'm in encamp stance, and the attrition from the plague is going away. So that's nice. The bear bids that's us nice. wait. Very nice. Okay, I'm gonna move up behind you a second. Yeah, I'm not worried about. Uh, yeah, we should be in good shape time wise now. Huh? If, if uh, Tally Master comes in and attacks me, I should be fine. I follow the bear! Does it automatically put you on the, the better mount that you pick up? Or do you still yes. have to go and change the mount? I mean, you, you can change your mount, but it gives you the latest one. Okay. Like, for us, yeah. But, like, for Cetra, you'd probably want to swap between him and his cherry and. Uh, Cat, cat, for example. Cat the chariot. Yeah. We're not picking up many magic items. Okay. Let's go ahead and spin some cashola. If it's a blade from Nurgle, I don't want it. <laughs> True. Just be covered well, in slime. Was... You could barely hold it. Right. Nice. Keep the puns coming. <laughs> they give air strength. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, there we go. Oh yeah, we're making excellent time right here. This is this is good. And I've been on like a Thrawn binge with Star Wars oh, stuff. Yeah. I read the original ones. And then I went and I'm working on the the newer trilogy that Zahn did, where it's like Thrawn and the Empire. Ooh. And then I finished reading the ones, like his prequels, basically, that Find he wrote to you. Yeah. Can't, can't get enough Thrawn right now. I think it's hilarious. Right. He's like the only bad guy that you want to win more than the good guys because he's just like a more I interesting character. <laughs> 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 it's like watching Sherlock Holmes in Star Wars or something. As long as it's not the Sherlock from the show, Sherlock, he sucked. <laughs> <laughs> what? Uh, Cumberbock? Yeah, he was just a raging Bar jerk. <laughs> <laughs> like, like, novel Sherlock was more eccentric, but, you know, like, you could tell he generally cared about people. Cumberbock Sherlock was just a jerk. I didn't it, ever read that, the novel, so I didn't know. Where, uh, it, it's that trend where, you know, smart people are jerks because it's depressing to be smart, Use I guess. I don't know. <laughs> depressing. <laughs> uh, are you able to reach that settlement? Um, If I come out of the camp, I believe so. Yeah, let's go ahead and knock that out so we can... Uh, yeah, I can get it. Start they making our way fall. back to our home settlements because there's gonna be some nastiness coming our way. Ooh, I do not. No, 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 I'm gonna I'm lose gonna a bunch lose of quite stuff. A lot. Yeah. <laughs> so this is a uh, madman gam gambled it. What? What is uh, gambled it? Gam Gambledipus. Oh, okay. So it's covering up part of it where it says take control. Yeah. Yeah, now what is gamble dip? Is that like the Probably. free chips and dip you get at the casino or something? Like, <laughs> it's the free chips and dip you get at the gas station. Yeah. In the bathroom. <laughs> Gambling with your life on that one. <laughs> it's like I would this not egg salad. Want... Like, wasn't that another Futurama episode where he eats the gas station egg salad and oh, like, gives him yeah, the brain he... worms? <laughs> yeah, that make him incredibly smart. <laughs> that episode was so good. I forgot. Were those worms actually gonna kill him, or did they just make him smart and? Yeah, they, they were like they were that. making him smart, and he wanted to know if Leah, uh, not Leah, Leela really loved him. Yeah. So he had to get rid of the worms. God, that scene where he's laughing about the joke, 
and then he just like explains the entire situation beyond the joke. Oh, so funny. <laughs> That's good stuff, man. I missed that show. I need to go watch it again. Uh, uh, oh, there's the city. I, just put I, my I still think that's probably my favorite TV show ever. What? King of the Hill more is than, right up there with than, it, too. More, more than Halo? Um, I didn't even watch the Halo show. <laughs> It's like, they said they're making a Halo show, and I was like, oh, okay, like, they, they mess up a lot of things, but this could be fun. And then they're like, yeah, it's our own take on Halo, not even the canon. I'm like, all right, I'm done before it even started. <laughs> so I just didn't even watch it. So I was like, no. Yeah. I was like, so you're going to make us a Halo show that's not Halo. Got it, but I mean, that makes a lot of sense. Yeah, I mean, you know, if Halo fans hate anything, it's Halo, right? <laughs> I mean, I'm sure yeah, some yeah, people yeah. enjoyed it, and that's fine, right? But I'm yeah, just like, yeah. no way, whatever. I'm not doing that. The Plus, you have to get, like, Paramount Plus on top of everything else plus on plus on plus. And... Yeah. Hooray, plus. new cable. Plus on yeah, plus. exactly. Cable's back. You just... Yeah. You, you thought you got rid of cable, but... Reggie says, Air, I would watch just the first fight from that show, and then the one scene where the Marine got his hog boarded by the grunt. <laughs> got boarded by a grunt? What a loser. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> you get jacked by a grunt. That's probably like a court martial offense, isn't it? it it's gotta <laughs> be something. Like. I don't know. When oh, Reggie and I were playing uh, Halo 2, we had this badass little grunt. We nicknamed <laughs> him Giblet. He was taking Giblet. out elites left and right. And we were just in the elevator with them, and then, like, someone threw a grenade in there and blew him up. I was, like, so sad. <laughs> yeah, boy, that was the name. That's perfect. But uh, he, was, he was just wrecking shop. Rest in peace, Giblet. Giblet. R.I.P. Okay. Um, Jar, what do you want to command? Uh, you want to take my archers and shoot Poo? Oh, yes, please. I didn't know you were playing Bretonia. Or here, just take a whole bunch of this stuff, actually, <laughs> while you're at it. Oh, by the way, I'm also very curious to see how Bretonia is going to be doing against the demon factions. You Watching know, those Grail Knights charge into demonic rank and file, like, woo! Yeah. So good. I've wondered. Yeah, yeah, that's going to be interesting. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm ready whenever. I'm really curious to see Wood Elves versus Kislev. For yeah, that's gonna be fun. Like, that, that's got to be a bit of a crazy battle. Like may, maybe it's not, right? Maybe we'll play it and it's no big deal. But like that <laughs> seems like that's gonna be an interesting one because it's just yeah, gonna I mean, be missiles on missile. It's gonna be missileception, like just right all over the place. Kislev with their Kosars with shields and pistols, just shooting back. Uh, Jar, remember we got troops coming in behind us. Oh, that's right. Okay. You might want to just turn around and shoot them to death, and then yeah, yeah, I'll come harass the other side and start capturing stuff. <laughs> For the motherland. Then Pilgrim will arrive precisely when he means to. For the people. G give or take Pilgrim a minute and a half. Uh, I gotta drink all my vodka real quick. Just. So. <laughs> Just imagine a drunken bear charge. <laughs> well, I guess if you ate a bunch of halflings that just came out of the pub, you know, for the bears, like they, they could probably get loaded. Oh yeah. <sighs> See, a like halflings win. We need we need something like even if it's just a mercenary unit or something. Oh, we're definitely gonna uh, lump in crooks fighting cocks. We we absolutely are. <laughs> that name. Gosh. Oh yeah, it's really come up with this stuff. I swear, some of the best names I've ever seen have been in the Warhammer universe. Best and worst. <laughs> like like you you got funny stuff like that, then you got blatant ripoffs like Curious Geezer. <laughs> yeah, or uh. Obi Wan Sherlock Crusoe. Yeah. What? Can't yeah. Forget him. yeah. Uh, in in the Rogue Trader days, there was an Imperial Inquisitor named 
Obi Wan Sherlock Clouseau. Clouseau. <laughs> Sherlock Clouseau. What the heck? They're just like going for all of them there, huh? Yeah, I mean, yeah, with with no shame either. <laughs> okay, I'm working on some capture points, but I got stupid rot flies coming after me. Then, then you have <laughs> such world renowned <laughs> natural wonders such as the Amaxon River. <laughs> hey, that's not a ripoff of anything. That's totally unique. Oh, yeah, you're right, my bad. <laughs> the river yeah, Amaxon? Yeah. Who's I mean, Warner probably has never heard of anything like that. No, definitely not. Holy crap, this is a lot of people. A lot of... Uh, yeah, let him blob up over there on your left against those Kassars. I'll hit him with a Heart of Winter. All right. Sleds. That's good, right? It is my path. Follow the frost. Okay, let's go. Ah, God. Yeah, 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 come on, bring, bring that blob up here, you filthy nurglings. Come get it. Death to nurgle. I got your cure right here. I am. Oh. Death to Carson, but whatever. I got your cure. That spell kind of misclicked, so I hope it still connects to these units. Did not do as much as I had always put it. Should have. My war bears are fighting hard. Forky's Lev. Forky's Lev. Wait, how come I didn't do any damage on the Heart of Winter? What the heck? What happened? I dropped the Heart of Winter right on him and it didn't do like hardly anything. Maybe Nurgle's cheating. Yeah, I mean, something like that. He's a demon you can't trust. There we go. Got a little bit done. There's that freaking soul grinder back there that's grinding our souls. Makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> Leading us on. Okay, we killing the reinforcements Blizzard. did not go as Blizzard. well as I had hoped. I go. Die. Seeking opportunity. Oh yeah, we're we're crumping. We're crumping. Get another heart of winter out here in just a second, I think. We're shooting to the deep right here. All right, this one hopefully will do the trick. These exalted plague bearers are getting slapped yes. and clapped. Heck yeah. Okay, yeah, that, right. that I Heart of Winter. Yeah. I guess the Heart of Winter did work. I just forgot that Nurgle has a million hit points. <laughs> it's my mistake. Okay, well that certainly got rid of a lot of them. Frost I can't wait for Nurgle to Ready die. For... It will be great. The motherland's finest. I'm gonna bring the sleds up, help Very mop well. up the rest of this. I will say it only hurts my heart a little to shoot the Nurglings. I forgot about that <laughs> reinforcing armor, or else I should have just kept the sleds over here the whole time. I'm sorry, Nerglings, I like you. I will kill you last. Yes. I like just how many of the Nurgle units have a Nurgling that comes out of them somewhere. Oh, yeah. yeah. Well, it's somewhere is... Nurglings out of every nook and cranny. Yeah. I'm gonna kill this beast of Nurgle, and then if you want to see if you can peel off those archers and shoot that grinder back there. All right. Go with the Oh no, Madman Gamboldipus is coming. Gamboldipus? Gamboldipus? <laughs> Gamboldipus. Alright, Beastie Boys of Nurgle. Kislev, send us forth. Kislevites, 
Oh, that's another thing. I, I cannot wait to see Beastman fight demons. <laughs> like, really, really, I'm just excited for every possible matchup. Yeah. What are Beastman would do against Corn? I feel like they might get buried in armor, but then again, they do have a lot of, like, monster options. Well, yeah, I mean, Beastmen are like, they hit hard and hit fast, and if you don't kill them on the initial fight, not uh -oh. good for them, right? Jar, are you alive? Yeah, I'm here. Hold up. Okay. Let me see if I can... I, it's coming back alive. I don't know what's going on. It's something. I don't think it's me. I still got internet. Come on. Come on. You can do it. Oh. Oh. Just oh. gotten out of sync or something. I don't know. Something weird happened. But we're yeah. good. We're good. Gamble to Puss is disintegrating. All is well in the world. Oh gosh, Kiss stay away from that giant leader. grinder. Make haste. On the match! Gamboldipus Siege of Rome went. <laughs> Gamboldipus Siege of Rome. Eris, the content your followers demand. It is, you know. <laughs> and speaking of content, I'm thinking about switching some stuff. Like, life is getting so crazy, it's really hard to record, and then it's like. I run series, then people don't want to watch them all the way through, and I get it. I wouldn't either. Probably like watch something out to like you know, a million episodes or whatever it is that these things yeah. run to, and then I mean, I'm thinking about just like switching to like mostly streaming, like do like three streams a week, and then just cutting some videos out of that, and then taking replays from the multiplayer streams and turning those into videos. Yeah. Like maybe that way, whatever time I'm spending is time playing and like people who can join can join and then those who can't we make content out of it yeah yeah i know for me at least historically um some of the the content i've enjoyed the most has been like commentating over multiplayer battles yeah and i can't uh, play them unless it's going to be on a stream because i just don't have any other yeah. time to do it so yeah, if i fair. stream more then i'd have more time to play them all right so we could even do like little amateur tournaments and stuff I mean, that would be fun. Yeah, that would I, be fun. I have a big uh, community tournament, when, or just bash once IE comes out. Yep. Yeah, I'm definitely thinking about that, like picking three days a week and just streaming. Yeah. Would simplify things for me, I think. My frozen yeah. kingdom expands. Then I don't have to worry as much about like what to record or oh, yeah. just, you know, did I make a clickbait enough thumbnail or whatever? Like I can just cut videos out of like we have a cool battle in the stream, we can cut that out, or I can save yeah. the replay. Same thing for multiplayer stuff like that. All right, next turn we should win part one. <laughs> Excellent. Nice. Um, part two is gonna be the doozy. The big doozy. All right. Defy chaos. I love how you can you know, do things simultaneously. That is just so much oh, better. Oh, it's so good. It's so good. Yeah. Great yeah. decision. Like I, I think I said it before. Like I wouldn't have been heartbroken if it was still sequential, but I definitely wanted more players a gift available from in the campaign great gods. than two. Two just felt bad. Yes. <laughs> like it sucked having like friends in the Discord like wanting to play but we can't because someone's already playing <laughs> yeah all right and then you end up with like a bajillion campaigns yeah yeah i mean i still end up with a bajillion i mean yeah yeah but it's a bajillion with a bunch of people i don't know man. <laughs> yeah the way immortal empire is shaping up everybody's gonna want to play a bajillion campaigns that's yeah. so true yep Oh man, myself. It's looking good. There's some fun starts. Like I feel like, like Grom Brindle's definitely top of my list. But I feel like Oxyodel is gonna be really cool because now there's like way more chaos to slay. Yeah. And then you've also got some other interesting. Like I was wondering though, like what did you all think of? Is isn't Nakai like up in the? Is, that, is he in the dark land? I'm trying to remember where he was at. Like N Nakai is in the south of Cathay. Or are you thinking Nakari? No, Nakai. 
Yeah, Nick Gator, in Gator Golf. Yeah, he he's he's golfing on the Kazan course. That's right. I mean, that could be fine. I, I heard some people talking like they didn't like that. And I'm thinking, I don't know. What's I wrong mean, with him being right there? I mean, he's right next to a sea lane to Lustria, so you could see just sail over deal. if you really want to. The, the only big deal, quote unquote, is that if you want AI Nakai to be in Lustria, that depends if they're going to do what they do in Warhammer 2, where he'll just start next to Marcus or not. Did we kill Spurt Mildew? Uh, probably something. Okay. <laughs> CJ wanted us to kill Spurt Mildew for him. Christian! I don't see him. Yeah, I think we did kill him. I don't see him. It must mean he's dead. Oh, if you uh, hold space air, you can um, lock floating character names, so they're always up. Ah, Andy. Yeah, um... That, that's what I do, but I, I don't see a spurt mill do. I see Toxfarter. I see Madman Worm Nest. So Toxfarter is like every person in my office at about 9.30 a.m. after they've had a giant breakfast burrito and multiple oh. rounds of coffee. Oh, God. Oh, no. Yeah, it's like you, you go to the bathroom and you're just like, I mean, sometimes you open the door and it, it's like Nurgle punches you in the face when you walk in. No, 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 Error. They're, they're just free space heaters. <laughs> Auto Resolve's gonna steal all my units, so we gotta fight this one. Okay, D did they attack you a lot? Oh, I'm not, I can't even reinforce it. Oh, what? <laughs> this little gobbledygook of a force. Yeah, it like... says they're gonna kill off like four or five of my units. What? <laughs> they're gonna get trucked by sleds. Nothing more, nothing less. The, the true revenge. <laughs> Super dudes. Let's see, Oof says I feel like putting Nakai where he is. In I hope he doesn't get killed too early. I mean, it depends on whether Cathay snowballs a lot, and then the Nakai curse. <laughs> Turn five. Honestly, I feel like they need to address some of his action mechanics. Like they, they, were... they, they, they said they want to. It's okay, just a matter good. of when they will. But they, he's like at the top of the. It wasn't list bad. It just needed. It needs some tweaks, and you know they, maybe a few changes really need, here and there, and a few things like. Well, what they really need is to make his vassals not so useless. Yes, <laughs> that would they certainly help. They do absolutely nothing. <laughs> they barely give you any money because they don't build anything. <laughs> yeah, they're really bad. So we're defending the settlement. What is this joke? Um, I'm gonna put a bunch of my units that I don't want I, I dead. Don't, I don't think back you got back. that there. I, I think this is gonna be a really hard fought battle. Yeah, it's, it's gonna be this rough. Blistragol is gonna conquer your city. Marina Katarin. He's, he's gonna make a face the full beastmen of poop mounds. Sled lead. <laughs> he's gonna he's gonna make the beastmen poop mounds look like boxes of tissue. <laughs> Clogs. Oh, God. Look at this guy's fingernails. They're like. Which guy? Like, Bush for goal. Oh, yeah. No. Just... We fight for Olsen. Okay. All the better to pick my belly button with. We are all these my units, or are you controlling for all the world depends Here, on you want to suicide some of my garrison? Fight with pride, <laughs> my people! Patreon. Oh, gosh. This garrison would last, like, Watch half a second. <laughs> There. If you all get a chance, make sure to kill someone. I go. I will. Do what Patchy would do: anything. throw his troops away needlessly in battle. Oh, Heck oh. Yeah. so there's a guy. I don't know if you ever played the Soul series, but there's a guy named Patches, and he is hilarious. Like he's just, he's just like a Skaven, basically, like in personality. <laughs> And, and in one of the boss fights in Elden Ring, like, you can summon him to help you. And the second you summon him, he just, he just vanishes from the world. It just says he, he's <laughs> returned to his world. He just retreats the second he sees who you're fighting. <laughs> yeah, I, I just cast Invincible on in all my troops. Good old patches. Yeah, good old patches. Yeah, he likes to kick people off cliffs, too. Yes, he does. I've got Crystal Sanctuary down for a minute so I can yeah, just shoot these. Uh, Christian says his whole thing is literally tricking people into dying so he can sell their stuff. 
every capitalist dream. <laughs> Serena Catherine! Oh, yeah, buddy. The frost I think I got a kill. Yay, oh, I got a kill! <laughs> Basically the god of kisses. I just need to pull back and shoot this blister girl. Yeah. Or if y'all want to sacrifice some of those garrison units to... Oh, yeah. I mean, they're definitely willing to be sacrificed. Every, every Kislevite lost is a tragedy here. Ah, no, 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 no. We're going more Darth Vader here, not, not, not Admiral Thrawn. Like, we don't take care of our troops and use them wisely. We dispose of them whenever we feel like it. <laughs> Christian says Kislev's in the market for a new god anyway. <laughs> I like it, I like. <laughs> Kislev in shambles. Yeah, what a what a terrible way to just get killed. Just someone belly pukes on you. Yeah. You're in the top one percent of <laughs> bodyguards in the entirety of your country, and then you get killed by belly puke. I love the the Zargard I'm looking at right now. He used to be a Zargard until he took that ice arrow to the shoulder. Oh. oh. That's funny. Oh yeah, I see him. A trail. <laughs> Yeah, there's a few of them like that. They've got arrows in their shoulder from their own people. <laughs> it's like you work like, your way you all go. the way to top to be a Zargard. You're like, look, Ma, I'm a Zargard. <laughs> Going to battle. I mean, who knows? Maybe it's so cold where they live, the blood automatically just freezes. Yeah, I guess so. Uh, it kind of, like, <laughs> freeze cauterizes the wound. Yeah. <laughs> freeze dries the wound. <laughs> Yeah, the magic yeah. ice arrows would be nice, I guess, for like assassinations, right? No evidence. Right. The the the, the mythical ice bullet. <laughs> Sweet. Oh man, I didn't really get to read that, but <laughs> it's a cash. quote talking about uh, <laughs> that giant river at the edge of the Great Bastion, where they people think that's a good dead. place to cross. Friends of Kislev. <laughs> Some Cathayan general's like, yeah, only idiots try that. <laughs> I can't imagine crossing any body of water in the Warhammer universe is going to lead to anything but your death. Right? Yeah. Can you imagine if there's like some planet out there where our planet's like a hellhole compared to theirs? <laughs> like, 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 their oceans don't have storms or something crazy. There's like, like no that. storms, <laughs> and instead of great white sharks, they have like sea bunnies and. Like, sea bunnies. Like, no one gets <laughs> hungry, ever. Like, energy is just perpetual there. <laughs> it doesn't make any sense, but like... It just know, happens. I I'm sure our world would make no sense to the Warhammer folks. <laughs> They're like, Fair. wait, 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 there aren't demons trying to eat you? You're lying. <laughs> You're lying, boy. Onward! Alright, so, Air, I recommend getting to your capital city as soon as be besieged ice. very quickly, very soon. Okay, I'll take your word for it. Um, Jar, same thing. Jar, you're gonna have a lot of Cornates. Air, you're gonna have Slaneshis, and I'm gonna have Zinchians. It's gonna be super, super fun. Hopefully I don't get ambushed oh. by Teach. I was like, why won't it let me garrison in this settlement? Five, yeah, it's because it's yours. <laughs> Betrayal! <laughs> <laughs> so are we gonna yeah. lose what we just took or maybe they i didn't get too far in the second part because i got ambushed by two zinch armies and they just murdered me so i don't know <laughs> we shall see like i was like oh no prog's under siege by slaneshis and zinchians let me go protect it and zinch ambush <laughs> Boris lost three lives that day. Three of his cat lives. <laughs> Boris the cat. What are you all playing first over there in the chat uh, in Immortal Empires? Like, what's what's the first faction? Curious to see what people say. I think I'm going Grom Brindle. Unless I see something else. I, I am tied between Kateb and Kairos. I really don't know. <laughs> Kairos is my favorite Tomb King, followed mostly by Cetro, but like, I love Zinch Demons too, so it's it's hard. 
Which rats? CJ. Oh god, he's going Franken rat. Kim King Supremacy, <laughs> Britonia, Catarin followed by Franz. Demon Prince. I mean, Bellacor and the Demon Prince look like they're gonna be a lot of fun too. Like, Bellacor, I'm really anxious to try. <laughs> Carl, Alario, Krokgar, oh, Boris. Karip! Kalar, Karalario? I'm turning into Chaos Bond, help. <laughs> oh no. I can't talk. Dude, Legamus Cetra is gonna Karelio. have like the, the Thunderdome going on around him. Like, I mean, it is gonna be. Dude, Cetra will own that dome. He will slap and clap everybody. <laughs> I'll tell you what, though, you're gonna have to stack it, it up some skeleton problem. archers because you got corn nearby. I mean, corn is gonna crack skeleton skulls all day long. Like, you're gonna have to use the archers early on. The problem is, there's gonna be Cetra in the way. <laughs> uh, true. I mean, it, how quickly can he get to a good mount, though? Scar Scarbrand, he doesn't need a mount. <laughs> Cetra's gonna. Cetra's got that blessed blade. Petra's gonna blind Scarbrand. Scarbrand won't know what, where he's swinging. Cetra's just gonna alley oop him. All right, so we gotta get back to our capital. And, and this isn't this isn't uh, propaganda, by the way. This is truth, this facts. Shall be yeah, 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 yeah. A pale shadow, of my palace. Nagash worshippers don't want it to be true, but it is. Okay, so next turn I'll make it back to Kislev. Uh. Oh, you're at war with the stupid clan Mulder? Ow! Oh. Yeah, they're Frank heading straight for my settlement. Is that gonna hurt our victory condition? No, we're, we're done with that. Okay, part. so it's not like if you're not holding it at the end of that turn. Oh, wait, control the following. Yeah, no, we won that part. Okay. So it says Razor Sack Plesk. Wait, that's not a victory condition thing. Oh, okay. Yeah, Plesk is just a random mission. Destroy them! Dora, son! Why? They're sending me in, like, to the border of the world's this edge mountains to go raise the city. Sure. Like, sure, let me yeah. just do that real quick. The great no yeah. problem. March through Zinch territory. No problem. Ooh, Talson. Hi, Talson. Gold. Uh, we got Trogorian Utter Blight. Utter Blight. Port Ostrosk is not going to have much of a garrison to hold back Trot if he attacks it quickly. His brain's too full of warpstone to accept any peace conditions. <laughs> I. I... My, my heart goes out to anyone here, Cetra. I'm sorry, you guys. <laughs> you lived long. <laughs> I mean, the kings are going to be just fine in the late into any game. I mean, you get all those shopty yeah. with a great bow and stuff like that. I mean, you can mow down a lot. I'm I'm just out of resolving this one. This is whatever. The remnants of Nurgle just popping up. All right, they besieged Ostros. It doesn't matter, I guess. I will not repeat the first time I played this campaign. <laughs> okay, I'm back in my capital. <coughs> I'm actually losing money. I don't like that. I got some. Okay, garrison's not amazing. Why is the garrison kind of crappy? Wait. It's like it was way better in the base game. Why? I didn't click Tor. God. Oh, I think I built the wrong fence thing, maybe? Boris, assist. Uh, I built the wrong defense chain. You fool! Yeah, indeed. All is lost. Uh, I gotta tear that down and rebuild something. Jar, reprimand him. We're not gonna be attacked oh, in the God. next turn, are we? No. Okay. Oh, we, we shouldn't be. At least I don't know. <laughs> This is this is where the unknown becomes the mighty. Um, Jar is gonna be attacked pretty hard. I know that. Yeah. 
Yeah. Um, How are you feeling about that, Jar? Good? Oh my god, three stacks attacking Zoyshank. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> Where at? Zoyshank. Uh, no, city captured from the Nurgle. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's, that's it says corn. A valiant defeat here. Um, all right, all right, let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Sweet, merciful cornflakes. <laughs> <coughs> yeah, any way to sure maximize all that streltsy though? I mean, that is a lot of streltsy. Like, we have some way to capitalize on that. Oh, don't worry. They they will die. <laughs> <coughs> when you wow. hear the revving of the corn motorcycles, all is lost. <laughs> Look at those corn sacks. It's Eddie. <laughs> It is. It's a today, the the. What's with all yeah. the apostrophes? Uh, the, the, he's actually a worshiper of the Tau. He's part of the Tau Empire. Oh, oh okay, yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> Back in um third edition, uh, uh, fantasy games workshop. Oh, well, actually, it was more fantasy and 40k. Games Workshop had this fun little thing where you can make your own demon have, like, their true name. The name that you would spell to have utter control of your demon. And it was just a jumble of letters, and sometimes you'll see demons running around the campaign map with names generated by that table. It's really fun. Nice. <laughs> That's cool. Like, if you ever saw, like, a demon with, like, whatever, like, that's... That's one of them. What's the way to play this the best? I don't know. I I I I don't know. <laughs> See, CA designed these maps, and don't get hey, me wrong, like wrong. it's way better than not having a settlement battle at all. But I still feel like the maps, in some ways, are like trying to be too fair to the attackers. Like, I mean, who designs that many entry points into your defensive position? You know what I mean? Like, it's just I, I don't get it. Yeah. Should yeah, be brutal. They, yeah, um, it's definitely a tricky balancing act because, like, you don't want it to have like one point where it's a really boring to attack the set a bunch yeah. of times, but too many, it's like, why have them? I feel like with Kislev, there should be places where they can garrison units up, shoot down into like murder holes, where if you sacrifice some melee troops, you get more shooting time. There should Three honestly just be bear traps everywhere. That just too. Like, like giant to... bear traps. Scarbrand sure. step in one. Have to chop his own foot off. <laughs> oh. And and then actual bear traps. Like where you just step on it and a bear pops out. Oh, where do we... Yeah. Where do we... Do we want to like split up and kind of each... Yeah, I'm really not sure. <laughs> yeah, I'm wondering what the play is here because... I mean... Char, th this is your army. Yeah. This is your city, so whatever I mean, you want. I fair. I have no idea. Uh, <laughs> yeah, so okay, so cause here's here's kind of what I'm thinking. Is it is it a good idea to try to resist like on the outskirts of the city, or should we should we try to pull in and maybe cede some of that territory and like hold on to like I don't know. Certainly don't want to give them extra melee attack. That's yeah. fair. That's fair. That's absolutely uh, true. Well, and see, and from my side, there's going to be two additional armies coming. So I wonder if the play is, like, can is there any way to maybe more quickly knock out these these two sides that won't get more reinforcements? Probably, actually. That's a good idea. Hmm. Yeah. Because the side with the reinforcements were, that's just going to be bad. <laughs> yeah. Skull crushers. Gosh dang, man. Soul grinder. Yeah, there's no quick way to go through so, any of this. So stuff, the though. side on here really doesn't have that much. Like, if we're able to get some Streltsy, if we're able to get some Streltsy to fire from the back and hit the, you know, Minotaurs and uh, Skull Cannon, I think we could wipe this side out pretty quick. Can someone yeah. hold the other spots, like, though? Like, I. I yeah, um, let's see. Oh, this is definitely tricky. What kind of melee do we got? Any? Uh, uh we have Zergard. 
Yeah. We yeah I wonder if you can use Zargard. Zargard to try and plug a gap long enough to shoot the snot out of anything large. That, that's what I'm thinking. Like, if I could plug this gap up here, but I don't really know how the Zargard are going to handle Minotaur's corn with great weapons. It's going to be rough. <laughs> <coughs> Like, so if we have the Zargard, maybe you split the Zargard between it, like, maybe put one, one Zargard, okay, so here, let me see if so I can like figure this. out how to ping here, I'm going to turn on the telestrations, so like, if you have a Zargard here, yeah, and then an armored Kassar behind them, and then Streltsy kind of in a position back behind that, so it's see, like, uh, try and tank it. The... Yeah, I'm curious about the Kosars being behind because I don't know if they'll actually be able to hit from behind. Because uh, the look at this elevation's terrain. pretty flat. Streltsy might be able to from far enough away, don't you think? Yeah, probably. Well, maybe the, just uh, stick them both up front, let them hold in, and yeah. we shoot the stuff off of them with the Streltsy. Yeah, yeah, that, that's what I was thinking. Um, if like those guys can hold the line and then the Streltsy shoot at the big things. That are pretty tall. I I think that will work. That do skull want, cannon's gonna tear into us a little bit. Do yeah, we want I, barricades anywhere? How long will I they hold? I don't know. We don't we don't really start with that much supply, so I don't know. Are you better off if, buying if, a tower if, somewhere if, and letting it if, do some like, damage? If you could buy if you could buy some time, like to prevent those guys from getting too far, that might be nice. Maybe. We definitely mm -hmm. don't want them capturing the city center. That would be bad. Um, you could yeah. build a couple barricades to slow down those like, guys. You, you could build there. Towers are also really effective. Um, Let's go, lads! Yeah. Two more! I'll just mm -hmm. put one Streltsy behind. Well, you've, you've got this formation covered over here. Oh, Eric, you got a donation from Simple Man. Yeah, Simple Man, thanks for the 10. He says, hey, uh, first stream I've been able to catch. Just want to show support. Thanks for making, uh, cons I don't know about consistent. You say consistent quality. I feel like I've been anything but consistent recently. But appreciate it. <laughs> uh, is this throughout the years? Been watching for 12 years. Well, you've been here since pretty much the beginning then. I think I, I started a little bit before then. Um, but yeah, it's, that's pretty much all the way back. About as far back as old man Eric goes. I wonder if there's any elevation. Thank you so much, Simple Man. Appreciate the support. Thanks for being here tonight. See whether this ends up being possible. Uh, all right, I'm gonna focus the rest of my troops on. I wish I could build stuff too. <laughs> <laughs> It'd be cool if we all got supplies, yeah. I wonder if I could sacrifice this patriarch to like be bait and then shoot the crap out of some stuff with the Streltsy. Maybe. I mean, we got we got discount Balrog over here. <laughs> discount Balrog. I like it. All right, I'm gonna try it. I may have to run back, but I guess I'm ready. Let's just see yeah, what happens. I'm ready. Okay. At worst, we lose. Correct. <laughs> <laughs> the worst you can do is die, right? Simple Man says your Rome Carthage campaign was what I started with. Oh man, yeah, that was that was definitely the beginning. <laughs> the OG Carthage campaign. I remember the Rome 2, the first Carthage campaign as well, and it they had like the teleportation stack of Civil War stuff that came in. Oh. It was like 20 stacks of just like top tier gold chevron nonsense. Oh, yeah. dude, look at those exalted blood, blood letters just get pistol whipped. Well, not yeah. whipped. Just oh, shot. man, yeah, they got yeah. melted. Die, demons, die! All right, perfect. Perfect. All right, uh, whoever is controlling those Kosars behind these guys and Streltsy, let's go ahead and wrap around to finish off that little squad. Okay, okay. Oh, where are those strolls? Oh, they're there. <laughs> Going I was like, oh no, strolls. Oh, crap. Oh, those Minotaurs got blasted. Oh my goodness. Does anybody have any cav that can hold this um, corn mobile off of me? My strolls over here? Uh, yeah, I, I apparently do. Like right here? Oh, oh, wait, how far are they? Oh, no, they're all the way across the city, never mind. <laughs> I managed to get the Bloodthirster pretty much. 
It's almost. Yeah, gone. I got some stuff on the way. All right, we are we are slapping. We are doing great. If uh, Air, if you could get the Streltsy to just blast the uh, Skull Cannon, uh, Jars, Kosars with Spear yeah. should be able to keep it off of you. Yeah, I'll come blast that. Got a, I got a Streltsy that I'd really need help saving, and it looks like he got a cab over here, like a Dervish on the way. That should, that should help a lot. Yeah. Dervish, just... Araby. Huh? Lock it, then we'll. Okay, I got the I got the bloodthirster. Oh my goodness, that's a lot of blood crushers. Oh. <laughs> Sweet mercy. This is not good. Oh, and skull crushers. I don't think war bears beat skull crushers. Skull crushers are. The Bone trooper. Amazing. Bone troopers dropping the fifty bomb on me here. Holy crap! Nice. Clone Trooper, like, I'm gonna have to, nice. like, fly you in for some kind of, like, air con or something. <laughs> air con. Thank you so much, man. 59 says, I have returned. You have indeed. I gotta keep your Starship Trooper thing going. I'm trying to get it done for you. That game's pretty fun. I appreciate you donating that. I think he had a copy of it he sent to me. It's been a lot of fun to play. Plus, I, I love the, um... Like the voice lines and stuff they do, it's so ridiculous, like the propaganda nonsense, I, it's, it's hilarious. Do we got any magic? Because this giant corn blob could really use a bombardment or something. I do not have any magic. These war bears are doing their damnedest, but there's only, there's only so much bears can do against reckless hate. No. Oh, dang it, they actually summoned blood letters in a really good spot this time. Oh. Curse you! Hey, I can summon the right place now? Right? <laughs> they cut off my reinforcements going since... I didn't uh, know that was a thing. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, I... These bears are holding up this whole corn blob on this fight. Alright, well... Yeah, that, they, they can't hold anymore. What do we got? Um, I need to start. Good thing. Stuff. Good thing. Uh, Cornate Skull Crushers only have 130 armor. No big. Yeah, I mean it's, it's nothing. Some light armor. Yeah. Archers with light armor. Same thing. Yeah. Die, bloodthirster scum. All right. Um, Aaron Carthage. Uh, we should. Or Aaron Jar. <laughs> uh, we should start moving the guys we had on that little side over. Oh gosh, can you let your cheaper Kassars tank this incoming Gorby's Chariot and many, yep. many other enemies and then that cab behind there, the Dervishes will have to get ready to sacrifice them too. Yep, 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 yep. Moving Good old Gorby's. Gorby's are the best unit in the game. <laughs> Anyone who says otherwise is telling the truth. The Motherland's oh, they're oh. summoning again. No. Oh, no, no. good, a magic tower. Awesome. We got a tower up. Gosh, damn yeah. It. I yeah. think I'm cut off from a lot of the treat points. I'm trying to get this uh, small cornate force handled. They got a blood shrine and a bunch of chaos warriors. Crap. Skull crushers, death coming. Where did they come from? This is bad. Skull crushers are one of the coolest looking units in this entire game, and I'm so happy they're as badass as they look. <laughs> yeah, they're not what I want to be running into right now. We've got a Imagine. massive blob of corn that we really need some magic for. Oh, yeah, we do. Get out of there, morons. Run for your pathetic lives. Okay, well, we're gonna get crushed. Uh, I mean, at least we took out a couple of large targets. Yeah. I mean, hey, killing killing Minotaurs, spawn, skull cannons, like, that that's all good. Yeah, so these are so imagine imagine. <laughs> Holy crap, clone trooper! <laughs> Another fifty <laughs> says that makes a hundred, but it would cost you far much more than that to fly out. I live in Japan at the moment. Yeah, that's probably not Japan money. But I'll tell you what, if you ever uh, end up anywhere near, we'll have to get together. We'll make a video out of it. 
Uh, little did you know, Clone Trooper, Arkansas is a province of Japan. <laughs> Speaking of, uh, Clone Trooper, since you, uh, get a lot of sway around here for all the support, um, what other stuff do you want me making for you other than the, uh, Starship Troopers, or is that the, the go-to for you right now? Let me know what you're wanting. I'll make some stuff for you. Happy to. Thank you so much, man. You're, you're insane. Absolutely insane. Clone Trooper is... Like the VVV VIP. <laughs> I also think I gave him a billion salt pennies. I wonder if that's still on there. Jeez. A billion. It took billion that much to get him past Nikki. That's at least more than three. It is more than three. Taking position. Are you sure? I'm, I don't know. I'm, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't do math, bro. Did we get any towers up? Uh, yeah, I'm working on a second one right now. We just gotta defend the points that control those towers uh, with our lives! I currently am protecting the one that controls two of the towers, but it's not oh, looking man, good. Oh man, we're about to get really right. overrun. It is not looking good at all. No. This Buyer Blood passive is really good though. <laughs> Everyone loves Buyer Blood. <laughs> All right, uh, Jar, you got some Kosars near my units. Did you want me to control them, or do you want to keep using them? Uh, if you want to keep using them, uh, follow up my units back. Yep, yep, yep. I see. I see. This way. We gotta protect that cash. <laughs> I left because it seems impossible. Valiant defeat, let's go! Alright, I'm trying to just stick some strelty shots into this blob. Clone Trooper says he wants to see you make a video where you're just sitting there telling bad jokes. <laughs> just me telling bad jokes? Yeah. <laughs> he put that in the general chat. <laughs> oh, what, in the Discord? Yep. Okay. I was like, where is it? I don't see it. So, a video of me making Excellent. lame jokes? Eh, we, we might be able to do that. I can probably look up some uh, some bad stuff and then come up with some even worse. Sons of <laughs> By the end of it, uh, I'll have to put like a nausea warning up. Uh, yeah. Just just put the image of like coo gas before the video starts. Like, this may be you after watching this video. <laughs> Holy so, corn. Yeah, so, Air, um, basically, the Zinch and Slanesh versions of these armies are going to be coming for us. <laughs> uh, okay, that sounds, sounds good. Hey, Clone Trooper, you still playing the Minecraft? How'd your server go? Minecraft. Good old Minecraft. My, uh, my boys are always trying to get me to play Minecraft with them. I haven't done it in a long time. I need to do it. Uh, I'm dead. No. Good golly, good gosh. Fire blood! Let's go, baby! Are there any good mods for Minecraft where you get, like, guns and stuff? I, I feel like they need to add yeah. a flintlock pistol to Minecraft. I'm, I'm sure there are more mods that do... that add a pistol than there are mods for Total War in, in its entirety. <laughs> like, Minecraft That's true, there's, there's probably... Pretty, pretty huge amount. Oh yeah. Moving. Uh, there's a mod pack called Volts. Yeah, that's um, brutal. Yeah. How they trucked us there. And they're going for Aaron now. Yay. Well, I mean, we have to take away some positives from this. We did manage to kill some of the units. Some Gore Beast Chariots. Look like we got rid of Bloodthirster. Down some spawn. We got Shrine. Right, yeah. Skull Cannon. Yeah, take that, Eddie. <laughs> yeah. Stupid Eddie. You stupid big dumb. Mod Pack stupid. Ocean Block. What does the Ocean Block thing do? I, I, I need to. Like, learn a lot more about it. Minecraft is amazingly fun, considering how long it's been out. 
and yeah. I, I buried a lot of time into it for a while. It was pretty entertaining. There are some really awesome mod packs out there. Where's my Minecraft Total War? <laughs> CA, please. <laughs> All right, let me ask you this, Clone Trooper. Do you have this this stuff in Japan called rain and temperatures <laughs> below 100 degrees? Because if so, <clears throat> I might move over there. Like, I don't think we've had any rain since June 6th. <laughs> it's been triple-digit oh heat, like, ever since then. It's like I moved back to Arizona without going to Arizona. I mean, that's just a plus-plus. <laughs> <laughs> I would I would love some rain. You lived in a state that was defiant against God. Now it follows you. <laughs> yeah, Jacob says it's the same in Texas. Yeah, this whole part of the country, we have like a high pressure bubble like sitting right on top of us where no weather changes can come. It's like pushes away all the rain and like a magnifying glass, you know, that that punk kid hold the magnifying glass above the ants and burning them like that's that's what it feels oh, like here right now. Ugh. I guess in Japan uh, it probably really matters yeah, like how far sense. south or north you are, right? Because <coughs> the very south end is considerably warmer than the very is, north is end. Is someone still loading or am I just bugged out? Because um, I'm still on the pending action screen. That's what it says for me too. Same. Well, it, for me it has waiting and then uh Air's name keeps popping up, and then Pilgrim, you're just on there 24 7. Okay. Um, so, that was an end turn, right? Because we might there we have go. Re Oh, okay. Alright, cool. Awesome. Simple Man says it's the same in Kansas. Yeah, I gotta drive through Kansas soon. I'm going out to see my brother in Denver. I mean, Kansas and Arkansas, right? Yes, I'm the <laughs> Arkansas. Nurgle rebels are attacking. Uh, I mean, that looks like an auto resolve. Probably. Ice. It's just Nurgle rebels. They're... Give me all that cash. Range a little axe. Sweet. At least we got a plague from it. <laughs> I don't want to arrange an axe. Free speech is not a right, is my event. <laughs> what? Oh. <laughs> I can arrange a little accident oh, okay, I or gotcha. have a little talk. <laughs> they are one people. It's the dilemma thing. The Akshina can resolve this discreetly. While he espouses mayhem and heresy, perhaps a chimney could topple from a nearby rooftop. We will then buy the silence of all those who <laughs> ask questions. Perhaps a chimney will fall. I like that. I mean, I mean, perhaps. Maybe a chimney falls. Maybe it doesn't. Uh, I'm going to arrange a little accident. It's not great, but it's all I can do. I'll tell you what, Clone Trooper, if we do, if I do move to the streaming schedule, which I think I kind of want to, we got to do a Minecraft stream, then I'll come check out your server for one of the streams. Uh, Aaron, I'm going to try and see if I can come help you against the rats. Come on! I go for kiss. I'm going to see if that works while you build up down there. Thanks, Clone um, Trooper. I, I, you're the man. Like you're absolutely insane. Born to Let's see. That's Mistress a lot of, of money. Ice. That's a lot of money. Oh, I can build. It says lots of rain in Japan, but just heat. Yeah. I could build an outpost in your city, Jar. Hooray! All those Kislev units I didn't have access actually, to before. Actually, actually, if I do that. My rule grows it will improve the garrison. Right? Yeah, I mean, oh. an improved garrison could be worth it. That's true. I don't know how to <coughs> try and build the outpost again, because I clicked out of it, not really thinking. Hey, Clone Trooper, did you play all the way through the Starship Troopers game? Does it get pretty crazy? Okay, I'll we'll have to wait. Curious to see. Like, that game, I, I love the voice lines in that game. Like, it's it feels like... I've only seen the movie. I've never read the books. But, like, the voice lines seem hilariously true to the movie. Oh, no, no. You can't eat snow. Thrawn is a true champion. Bunch more furs <laughs> that I can't train. 
All right, Jar, I'm going to send some forces maybe to distract them. I don't know. I don't know what I should do. Fair. Mad Winnie, thanks for the five. He says, can't you just let Nurgle invade your lands? I mean, just let you live forever. I, mean, I don't know. What do you all think? Just We just roll over and take the plague and then we won't have to worry about corn anymore? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I do hate me some Nurgle. Like, a lot. Letting Nurgle live is like letting Bodies a boil so exist insane. on your heel. What are you doing with Boris? I thought you had to guard your settlement. Should I stay in my I, settlement? I do, but, but honestly, I'm going to go protect Fort Ostrosk real quick, and then okay. I'll be right back down. Uh, well, Skaven will probably just attack it right before you get there. The AI is a bunch of turds that way. Probably, but then I, I can wipe them out, and then you don't have to worry I too much. I am truth. I mean, I'm sure this is a dumb idea, but we'll, we'll see. Because I don't want the Skaven then rampaging down south towards Bulgasgrad. This is true. We don't need that. Because if you lose Kislev, it will be nice to have a backup city. <laughs> Military outpost. So if I build an outpost for you, it'll do the same thing. Like, it'll help improve your garrison. Yeah, a nicer garrison. And you'll eventually be able to build some free troops, even if they are the same type of units you can already make. Because oh. they cost alliance points. Oh, that's true, true, true. Although they still cost upkeep, so maybe not worth it. I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll so, see. <laughs> I got I got heaps of money sitting around from all the Nurgle stuff. I'm gonna get By some non-aggression packs and try and get some money off these empire factions. Oh, and they don't have man, the balance man, offer man. thing on here. That's ridiculous. I mean, they don't have anything to balance it with. Probably. Great agreement. No, you can't ask him for money. That's weird. Yeah, yeah, I couldn't ask you for money either. Ah. Uh. Crackronid. Well, I mean, I guess we should might as well, though. We'd want non-aggression packs with all the Empire factions, right? Who's everyone's favorite yeah. Skaven legendary lord, and why is it Throt? And why is it Throt? <laughs> I just why got a military it? alliance. As you say, sir. With Ostland. Like, yeah, yeah, Icky gets nukes and whatever, but, like, Thrott, like, roll. have you seen how he eats warp stun? Like, that's crazy, bro. Anyone uh, can launch I'm going a nuke. with the nukes, though. Let's hear what you Anyone have to could say. launch a nuke. We'll Not everyone can just gold. eat giant blocks of warp stun. <laughs> <laughs> I am making many alliances. Go on, then. That's good. The Empire. I don't know whether it's gonna do anything good for us, but I have peace. hopes. Jar, how's your money? Agreed. Uh, I'm currently making money, uh, and I have five grand. But... All right. Approach us, friend. Oh, and oh, make well, your look offer. up north. You'll see uh, one of those demon names I was talking about earlier, Rugari Iluhan. Okay. <laughs> Whoa. Made many deals with the the Empire. Not Excellent. Palpatine's, unfortunately, so no, no Death Star. Oh, I am the Senate. <coughs> I am the Senate. I am the Electric Count. Uh, I am summoned. <laughs> yeah. Let's oh see. gosh, who's this Slaneshi? Hubas Ragulanas. <laughs> What's our Dang current me. objective? Probably, I don't think we have a specific one. I think it's just now, like... Just seems, getting hit? Or the, like, all the demons are gonna try and slap us. Okay, avoid demon slapping. Oh, I got a rebellion. Yay! Patriarch, eh? Oh, Kurt, Ulur, Kudalor, Patriarch of Kislev. <laughs> Isn't it sad? Like, I have winged lancers and Kassar spears, and I'm like, I'm kind of thinking about disbanding the winged lancers because I'm pretty sure I can get more kills with the Kassar spears. All right, I'm right next to your city now, Air, and I'm going to declare war on I these rats so that way if they attack your city, I'll reinforce. Absolute devotion. Die, Ratman. Die, Ratmans. 
And I think your voice lines are hilarious, but you Griffin must Legion's die. Griffin just not worth keeping. Like getting something that's gonna be better. Only the worthy may serve me. Call to prayer. Kneel before your queen. Oh man, my ice guard upkeep is really low. That's fantastic. Yeah. Heck. It's lower than Kassar Spears. What in the world? What am I doing? Yeah. That's what I was saying. Your uh, ice guard is really good no in this campaign. I hope I don't get attacked on the next turn because I'm disbanding a bunch of that trash and bringing in the good stuff. Oh, you know that's going to happen. I question like, Nakari's just going to pop up and be like, Oh, no. I will oh, my no mama. Pledge your hey, uh, Jar, you got a couple demons coming at you. Oh, yeah, I didn't notice. Um... Honestly, I, I am stacking some ice guard. <laughs> Char, I can't believe you didn't notice. They're right there. <laughs> Why? <What>? Uh... <laughs> Dang, cornates and their tricksy nature. Yeah, I know. In fact, I'm. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna stack some ice guard. I'm just gonna get rid of basically we everything and turn market. everything into ice guard because it has the cheapest upkeep. Upkeep, upkeep. Heck yeah. Might as well. Alright, there we go. That's right, back off, rats. Back off. Did they run? Yeah, they ran. Bunch of cowards. I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and push towards uh me before you clean. Oh, yeah. I got some ice guard now. Only the word I go for easy. Find a fight. Spreaders. Hey, there's there's there. I there. no complaint. It's the upkeep of the lights. Okay, yes, I don't know if Mercy heavy swords. The infidel dies. Maybe maybe the real Araby is the Boris we found along the way. Mm -hmm. Boris we found. Mm -hmm. Um, I would love Araby. Araby would be so cool. We are yeah, both that'd, that'd be done. That'd, you be, that'd be some good stuff. Together, we serve the motherland. I like all the factions. Right. Please. Yeah. Me before you. Okay. I, I just I can't wait for chaos to work. Like. My army is much more elite now. But Char, what about their hats? Boss <laughs> rule. Uh, yeah. Exactly. Are are you the Chaos Dwarf Check fan that hits. hates the hats or likes the hats? Uh, the I love land. the hats. Because there are, there are some that point. love that the more Chaos Warrior aesthetics, and then some that love the fifth edition aesthetics. I personally love the fifth edition aesthetics because they're hilarious. So yeah. for the Motherland is our current mission. We set the Septic Claw. Okay. Uh, so, or do we each get different missions? Yeah, I got different ones. Okay. But... There's no way I'm getting Plesk. Plesk, I think these are just random missions. Like, I, I think, yeah, so Truth. if you go to the, the victory conditions, I think we just have to retake. His oh, life. yeah, the four provinces. You're right. I we do have to take and maintain control of those four. Thank you. Which four? Yeah. We, we have to take Dukeless Forest, Eastern Oblast, Northern Oblast, and Troll Country. I'm, I'm running over to help Jar with his little demonic How problem. How long do we have? But, uh, this one's not a time limit. Okay. Sweet. But uh, basically, all the provinces of Kislev we have to reconquer. Okay. Well, my army's gonna be in much better condition to do so here. We're not yeah, expecting yeah. for me to just get, like, straight rolled or something here on the next turn. Well, I leave Kislev. <laughs> hopefully not. When Reggie pushed into the Slanashi territory, they came out of the woods. Like, they were, they were just. They come out her. groping? I mean, oh. probably, but, you face. know. I, it, it happened so fast. Like, <laughs> like cuz Sameshi's speed cannot be <laughs> underestimated. They came out grabbing. Oh no. I love uh -huh. Slanesh jokes. Like I think it's one of my favorite thing. I I know like early on I was making all these I mean, I'm sure that at some point I needed to just shut my mouth because it was probably getting painful with all my lame Slanesh jokes. But one of the people in the comments like just actually got offended because he's just a big Slanesh tabletop fan and thought I was like really running him down. I was like, no, I just I can't help it. Like they're they're so memey, I have to make fun of them. I mean, how can you run down Slanesh fans? They're too fast. 
One leg. <laughs> like, how can I not make fun of someone prancing around in hosiery? And all they do is every debauched thing ever. <laughs> hey, they're good Christians. Now, never you know? <laughs> they would never do such weird slanderous things. They will serve the mother. Oh, Slim I Ash. can't believe you're insinuating that. How dare. <laughs> Air, if you. Or not Air. Uh, Jar, if you can hold off a little bit, Boris is almost there. I, I don't know if I. Bear Daddy is almost there. Yeah, I don't need to. Oh, okay. Well, fine. I'll just. Go what's, what's happening? Is he sieged by all the Crimson Skull? <laughs> uh, not anymore, apparently. Where they, they ran? <laughs> no, I let me auto resolve and kill them all. Okay. <laughs> oh wait, the auto resolve let you just kill them all? Yeah. All right. Hey, that works. Yeah, I'll take it. The auto resolve giveth and it taketh away. Mostly wow. taketh. When it gives, that was awesome. taketh. Blizzard. All right. That's Arena. Match for Gisner. Yeah, I, I, uh, I clicked the attack order just to see like. You know, how, uh, how everything was looking, and it was like close victory, and I was like, oh. Alright, so the victory conditions then, so... The forest is off to my east, right? Yeah. Yeah, so all the Slaneshi territory is going to be part of the province. Should we uh, focus something together, or should we just yeah, I'll, split I'll be... up, or like, what do we want to do? Um, if you want to start pushing them, I think... That would be okay. I'll One make left. my way back okay. unless Jar, you need me to help you against the cornates, but I don't nah. think you will. Okay. All right. I so will. I'll, I'll just start sprinting my way back. Start pushing east then. <laughs> Got a lot of allies in the empire. I don't know if they'll listen or be helpful. Yeah, but... it will take 20 turns for us to get rid of all this Nurgle corruption. Good God. That is brutal. Stinky, CA, please. Stinky boy. CA. Some of the outposts. It's a good idea or not. Darn stinky buttheads. So I prove my right to rule. We demand your respect. Okay, let's see. Oh good. Valmir von Rokov is sending a force to and he's dead. <laughs> <laughs> the frozen kingdom welcomes all. Hey, look look at look in the chat how much salt that clone trooper has. Man, that's just an integer overflow. You can't me otherwise. <laughs> I mean that's definitely gotta be the, the big int data type. Yeah. So we got let's see. That is Is that three point four billion, I think? Maybe, I don't know. Yeah, I think it's 3.4 billion. He's, he's almost, I don't know. You know what, though? Um, here, I, I can fix that, too. Let's see. Don't you get pennies whenever you donate? Yeah, yeah, and then I think I can... Loyalty... Okay, yeah, search user. And the search doesn't work. Find Clone Trooper Wheeler on here. He's everywhere. You cannot escape him. Why doesn't it show him in my list here? He had to close out for a second or something. I don't know. Fresh this, see if I can find him. He is not the mighty Jingles. <laughs> I'm trying to give Clone Trooper Wheeler a whole bunch of pennies. Jacob says <laughs> Clone Trooper has stock. <laughs> he does. He's got a lot of stock here. I don't understand this list. Anyway, I can't find him on the list for some reason. That's really weird. All right, uh, defense alliance. Yes. 
Valmir got absolutely slapped by a very small force of cornades. Yeah, it was kind of funny, actually. <laughs> my role, Stop my decision. Here. I will bro, burn. Boris, no. you need to stop getting attrition, bro. You just range. need to, like, <laughs> ignore it. <laughs> just just ignore it. It hurts, bro. Uh, it hurts. My throne awaits. <laughs> Pledge your obedience to me. I need okay. buildings that get rid of corruption, like, obvious. desperately. I don't need this building. I'm going to deconstruct um... that building. Imminent rebellions, heck yeah! Rebellions are great. Just, just go with it. Everybody, I love a good rebellion every now and then. Yeah, everybody loves rebellions. It gives the people in power the ex an opportunity to get rid of people they don't like. It gives the people that are being oppressed the ability to get rid of the people in power. <laughs> just works out for everybody. Understand this, like it gives the Star Wars stories a crutch to lean on, you know, mm. stuff like that. Like Clone Trooper Wheeler, definitely in the chat. But when I go over here to like find someone in the chat, to, like because you can hand out, I can add points to all viewers. I mean, hey, why not? Who wants some pennies? You know what? Have fun gambling, folks. Here's here's ten thousand on the house. Wow. There we go. Let's see if that works. Y'all check your salt levels now and see if the payout comes. <laughs> Rip to anyone who's I'm not trying to give you a trillion salt pennies, clone trooper, but A trillion? You know, I was going for like the full on you know, Doctor Evil trillion here, but it's I'm sitting here looking at the user list to give it away and either it gives you all a name that isn't the YouTube username I see, or I can't find it. It's weird. I don't know how to explain it. If you're there in the chat. I can see you, but it doesn't show you on my list. Oh, good. Slaneshis are attacking Prague. Good. <laughs> Need some help? Probably. Ow. Oh, I'm going to lose. Oh, whatever. Do it. Can I beat this? Uh, uh, Jar, you could probably take this back. Yeah. This yeah. is the city I'm thinking of. Yeah, you could take that back. Oh, uh, they're attacking Bulga's grad. Ugh. All right, there we go. Yeah, I don't know. I'm trying to figure it out, Clone Trooper. I'm trying to get you your trillion hey, the pennies. Are here. But Streamlabs isn't cooperating. It acts like you're not in the stream, even though I see you there. Um, should we auto resolve this one? Yeah, it looks like an auto resolve. We are Kiesler! Oh, Air, are you able to help deter the Slaneshis yes. from attacking Prague? I will blot out the sky with ice arrows. Heck yeah. Oh, I've got a couple yeah, stacks of them headed towards me, comfort. though, too. Oh, yeah, you do. Mm. I um, should be able to reach Prague in time, maybe. Let's see. <laughs> Well, I mean, your garrison can probably... Destroy these fools. What oh, kind of yeah, garrison you got? Huh. A lot of cav, but I'll, I'll go ahead and just auto-resolve that. Hope that is okay. Did it work? Yeah, it seemed to. Alright, I'm gonna attack, um... That's Arena. What kind of army is these Slaneshi's? Oh, wow, that's a lot of mobility. Yeah, no, these Slaneshi you armies, they... They hit very hard. I feel like I can take them, though. Oh, they have pain for pleasure. None um, but Slanesh may dominate. What is this? Me. It gives their armies uh, plus twelve percent campaign range, plus twelve percent speed, plus twelve percent weapon strength, and plus twelve percent charge bonus. Think about laying an ambush right outside of Islev. That, that might work. I command it. Oh, thank you, Shaiyish. <laughs> Clone Trooper says that he is officially the head of the Royal doomed. Office of Salt Extraction. Nice. Absolutely. Absolutely. Heck yeah. 
An heir's corrupt government. You can have whatever position <laughs> you want. <laughs> okay, let me see here. Let's see if I can... What is going on with the... I'm trying to see if I can find. It's so I like weird. That like I see you all in there. chat, and I see the names there, but then when I go to search for those people in the chat, they're not there. Like, it's, I don't know what the heck Streamlabs is doing. Who knows? Maybe it has a different name under Streamlabs. I don't know. Well, it should be looking at their YouTube name. Maybe. Oh, Lord, that's a lot of Zinchians coming for me. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Trigosh Fekadiris is here. Fekadiris? Hey, uh, Air, Air, you got, a, you got quite a few Slaneshis. <laughs> yeah, Looks yeah, like there's they a couple. ignored your ambush. How did they ignore my ambush? They, they probably saw you. Yeah, I know, but, oh, like, no. how did they step through me like that to attack my settlement? That's... A little bit strange. You may touch I me only in. This is bad. This is bad. Oh, we can take this one right here, huh? Maybe. I don't know. I can't see till you. Uh, actually, fighting? I can. You're streaming. <laughs> <laughs> actually, the auto resolve <laughs> will kill those two armies without. And the only unit I lose is one of my garrison. Yeah, I guess. Or should we just kill them in person for the, the pleasure? I really want to use Watch my out. ice guard. Okay. Before the end of this battle. real quick. Yeah. Heck yeah. I mean, it's definitely a lot more fun to watch battles than watch auto resolves, right? <laughs> that's, for, that's for sure. At least, I think that's the case. <laughs> the battle for geese live! Oh, you, you, they are attacking outside. Oh, no, you're attacking them, right? Yeah, yeah. That's right. Zarina Katarin! <laughs> Bone Trooper Dude, needs what? decorations for his name. What, what kind of decorations do you put in the office of the Royal Salt Extractor? I mean, you gotta have some what? fancy salt shakers. Yeah. And then, like, probably a salt sculpture. Oh, absolutely. And then, absolutely. like, a little salt hot tub Dude, over in the side, salt. right? Deer salt. Oh, yeah, yeah. Deer salt for licking. Maybe it's, yeah, salt lick. Air, your favorite Keeper Secrets is here. Ooh, is he now? What is this Keeper of Secrets? Or are you just saying, because I get to look at the hosiery? Yeah. <laughs> Don't lie, you want pants like that. I, I do. <laughs> Since they make us go back to the office, I, I kind of do, actually. <laughs> like, hey, look, you're going to make me come in here? Enjoy. The, the, jar, <laughs> oh, the no. jar chariots over Stop, here are, <laughs> are just waiting to run you over. <laughs> it's funny that the fiends of Slamesh are wearing the same the sort of uh, leg wear that the Keeper Secrets is. <laughs> Okay, um, can I have someone? Oh, uh, yeah. Well, so there's going to be reinforcements coming in, right? And it's going to mm -hmm. come in behind them. So I definitely need one of you all to control those. If I hand yeah, over... Yeah, you could give them the Char. Um, Char is a good reinforcer. Can you give it to him before okay. the battle starts, or do you have to wait? No, you have to do it as they come okay. in. Okay. <coughs> thinking, if I give you the sleds, can you run them up and like start picking at those keepers? Sure. And basically, just lure them back to this archer line. I'm looking at the terrain here. The keepers are demonettes. Uh, the sleds. I'm thinking, go for the the keeper, right? Yeah, we can do that. Here, let me get these over. Pilgrim on the sled crew. And then, if I'm looking at the terrain. <laughs> I, kinda wanna I can't wait. I, I can't wait to see the mighty battle between Kislev sleds and Tomb King chariots. Just, just stretching as far as the eye can see. I need to let them close the distance any faster. So, 
and I'll keep um, my... I know, I know the Keeper of Secrets is going to catch the chariots, or the sleds, uh, so... If you're I don't think keep, so. Like, uh... like, I think if you just keep your distance, just lure him back into the archer fire is the idea, like... Okay. Um, and then I'm going to have my war bears waiting to kind of, like, hold. Yeah, yeah. And then that, I'll just cast Crystal thinking. Sanctuary and throw arrows into it. Like, yeah. So that's kind of what I want to do, is get him back here, I throw a Crystal Sanctuary, and then we just fill it full of arrows. Yeah. But the like, Mongol land expects victory. Right, yeah, go go Your get their attention. Get them over here. Like, see if you can, pay. because they're gonna sit on their butt and wait for the reinforcements. I think we don't want that. They'll sit on their Cold butt quickly. <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> Good old. Spawn of Slanesh. There we go, yeah, start getting some shots into anything that... Let's see if we can do some bear baiting. Imagine being a devout follower of Slanesh and you get turned into a spawn. You're like, thanks! <laughs> appreciate it. Neat. You know what though, they enjoy everything a little too much, so... Probably okay with yeah. it. I do appreciate Age of Sigmar going more into other aspects of Slanesh, like... Like, one of their lords is just, he wants to go around eating every type of food in the <laughs> entire existence. So, do, do he and Grom get along? Uh, maybe. I know he and Sigvald hate each other. <laughs> Look at this, man. That keeper's just gonna sit there and take it. He's like, yeah, yeah, it feels good. I mean, <laughs> what, that's what I expect this keeper to do, right? Like, that <laughs> searing hot lead. Yeah. Kislev might be cold enough to wear the, their ice bullets by the time they reach them. <laughs> True. Yeah, I'm I'm these idiots are just taking it. Yeah, I mean, they are not... They are not gonna budge. They want their reinforcements. That is gonna be a lot of Slaneshis all at one time. Yep. I wonder, though, if they go for the garrison, though, that'd almost be good, like, because that would keep them distracted for a while. Yeah. I wonder if I should move... I feel like I should move up. Because they might just turn on that garrison. But then you can hit them from the rear. I'm gonna start Wait. pushing archers forward. Yeah, they want that. Yeah. Dang it. I'm inadvertently giving Chaos all the power. Oh, oh, they did not like me moving. Oh, God. Oh, God. Slanesh is like, flank me, please. <laughs> flank me gently. Okay, yeah, yeah, keep him coming. Keep him coming. This is good. Run! Run! <laughs> this is good. Ah! When are they gonna make a survival, a Warhammer survival game? <laughs> yeah. Reinforcements are here. Good. We're gonna That's get to right. pick off some get of these slapped. units for get free. Slapped. Get slapped! No, run, bears! Oh, look at that okay. ice guard. See, see, ice guard are amazing. They're fantastic. Love them. Okay, now just block the. Ch I'm gonna block the charge of these units with my warbear riders. Fashion model coming in. Uh, Air, do you want to hand over the reinforcements? Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. Sorry. Oh, good. Um, here comes a mighty gift. There you go. Woo. All right, Zarina Katarin. Slow everything down. These guys out. If oh man, chaos they tore god. up some sleds. If, if Air was a chaos god, do you think his lesser demons would be Saltest? Yes. <laughs> yes. Apparently yes, lost the unit of bears. That's not good. Uh, recruiting's quick, so it's. I think I'm sacrificing it, it, a patriarch whether I, I intended to I or not. I see them getting hurt so fast they got lost. Uh, that's moving. no point on. Yeah, these Ice Guard are owning pretty well, though. Right? They're so good. I love Ice Guard. They're going to be pretty good yeah. melee against Slanesh, too, because they don't have any armor. Yeah. I can definitely tell the difference with the auto-resolve than when I first played this campaign, because every auto-resolve we were going to do were, like... Crushing defeat, crushing defeat, crushing defeat. Yeah. <laughs> Decisive defeat. Okay, oh, my ice guard have mowed down the first army. Alright. 
Jar, how are you doing over there? Do you need bear sled support? I would love bear sled support. Oh man, there are so many seekers and striders all over the place. Yeah. I can take the Zarina and the Ice Witch with your sleds because then I can use the magic that slows. Okay. Try and keep them off you for long enough. Yeah, I just. Those Hell Striders are Oh, that Patriarch. He's gotta be happy. Like, he just joined my army. And I literally just stuck him out in front of my army to take the full perversions of Slanesh while being shot at by all the I friendlies mean, with the arrows. He he lives, so clearly he wasn't doing a good What's enough. What's his name? <laughs> Peter. Yep. Yeah. It's like Peter, get get out there, pull your pants down, and, and distract that army. <laughs> he's like, what? <laughs> and then he's like, I'm not wearing any. I'm way ahead of you. <laughs> he's like, but 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 there's Slanesh. He's like, what are these pants you speak of? Think I'm some For weak Southlander that needs Ready pants? <laughs> March we don't Kislev. believe in pants here. Sarina Katarin! Ice Guard! Ooh, that Ice Guard melts so nice. Love it. Kislev's vengeance! Kislev's I don't think Ice Guard should be melting. Uh. <laughs> ice Guard! <laughs> yeah, there we go. There we go. Slaneshis, get wrecked, nerds. Jerks. I really hope they add God align these units to these rosters. Like Slangors, Zangors, Pestagors, and Corngors. Like, I want them. As a Beastie Boy fan, I need them. <laughs> what is that? Chaos God Align Beastmen or something? Yeah. Yeah, the... Because they were servants of Chaos, right? Yeah. In their eyes, they're the only true followers of Chaos. Ah. Repositioning! But the Chaos Gods don't really War care about them that much because they know the Beastmen are going to do what they say. The while Chris tempting Lemons. humans is a lot Moving. more fun because humans aren't guaranteed to do what they say. <laughs> <laughs> so, do the Chaos Gods properly appreciate the political animal that is Al Gorbel? <laughs> nope. <laughs> I mean, oh. he might overthrow them in an election. Mm -hmm. I hope. That would be fun. His destroy all humans policy definitely applies to, like, marauders and Obey the orthodoxy. Chaos hey man, Warriors. That was, a, that was a real fun game series if you ever played those. Destroy all humans. <laughs> Was like, that the Alien games? Yeah. We, those were pretty fun. <laughs> Cryptosporidium. That's right. Didn't they remake that recently? Yeah, and it was really good. <laughs> they remade number two, and I want to get that one because that one had co-op in it and was just lots of fun. You got to fight, like, not Godzilla in Tokyo. Whatever us and us. Kill that keeper! I'm trying, he's... My ice guard are shooting at him, but it's going rather slowly. Thank god this isn't tabletop where you can't shoot units that are engaged in melee. <laughs> oh yes. The toss is too great! Break them down! Alright, my ice guard are cutting through. Uh-oh, these light four sleds are in trouble. There's a billion fiends on them. Oh, I love Ice Guard. Fire, 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 Daka Daka! Hell yeah! Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Filthy oh, smashies. they have an achievement in Resident Evil 8 called Daka Daka. Daka <laughs> Daka. <laughs> they got the crossover. And, and one really hilarious thing mentioned in the... Um, FAQ, the Q&A today was, uh, ZA actually considered making orcs travel in the Red Sea Lane quicker. <laughs> they didn't end up doing it, but that would have been hilarious. <laughs> oh, yeah. Was... Slay them all and engorge my lust for depravity, Silas the Depraved. I love all these Ice Guard kills, man. That is just so, that's so good. Yeah. I am so b glad they brought back quotes for the loading screens <laughs> rather than the generic like game tips like right click to attack an enemy. 
Oh, uh, I am out of time for that. I gotta hop off. Um, and that was fun. Yeah, so that was we gotta yeah. keep this one. I don't. If you all are available, I'd like to keep it going until we finish it. Absolutely. So uh, next time we continue, there's gonna be a big Zinch siege on Kisla or on Prague. Sweet. Oh, hope they don't melt all my people into the streets. <laughs> terrible. Yeah. Like you know what? You know what works great for Zinch? Having people in a straight, flat alleyway for your flamers. <laughs> oh yes, oh. that's definitely. <laughs> Man, the, like, those flamers. Like, when I played that. Um... When we were playing the online battles a couple weeks ago, who was it that joined that game? I can't remember his. Was it Pugginton or someone joined? He had a bunch of flamers. Oh my gosh, man, he was crapping on us with the flamers. Um, I, think, so I think this is, this is death for me. Oh, okay. Right, I'm gonna move up and then we can go ahead and save. Oh. Sorry. Nurgle Rebels. <laughs> Nurgle Rebels? Okay, here we go. Prague may fall. <laughs> they're in, they're they are very injured from that auto resolve, and there are three Zinch armies marching on it. They gonna attack you straight way? Probably. Like my garrison is super beat up. Pledge your obedience to me. Did they respawn any of their crap? No, no. The, 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 the army that attacked me was a Slanesh army. Okay. And that got wiped out, but the Zir nine thousandth and. And Anansi, the Tinker, and Raptal <laughs> are, are, are gonna come blast me. All right. None shall well, question me. Um, so do we just need to save the game then? I'll hit save. Yep. Yep. I'll go ahead and hit save as well. All right. Hang on. How come it's, it got your name up on it? I guess it doesn't matter, right? It's just a file name. So, Rotten. Here it is. All right. Save it. All right. Well, th this was a lot of fun again, Air. Yeah, Thanks. it was awesome. Thanks. So was either next Tuesday or Wednesday, depending on how the time frame works out. Tomorrow night I'm going to do multiplayer battles. Yeah, yeah that's so fun. We'll jump in and get some multiplayer battles. And then, like I said, I may go to the three streams a week, which would allow us to maybe do like a multiplayer campaign or just some campaign on stream and then multiplayer battles. And then maybe I could add something like, I don't know, just like a variety one where I just pick what I want. I don't know. Like I'm thinking about it, like how we can add into it and fit more in yeah anyway thanks and then thank you everybody who is viewing appreciate the uh the folks here tonight all the support from clone trooper and others who were super chatting and folks just chatting it up enjoy the ten thousand salt pennies as well hopefully you all gambled them straight out <laughs> that's, that's what you're supposed to do with salt pennies anyway i'll see you all next time have fun thanks everyone